Uh, welcome to Ocala PD. Uh, I'm going to ask Reverend uh, Chaplain, sorry, Chaplain Reverend Gans to give our invitation. Let us pray. Creator God, we give you thanks for this day that you have given us and for the blessings uh, that you bestow upon us each day. We especially come before you uh, and give you thanks for these men and women who have given of themselves and of their time to learn how to be protectors of your people. We pray that your hand will be over them and watch over them and keep them safe. We especially pray for Kyle and Malaya and for Rachel, for Joseph, for Cedric, Emmanuel, and Richard. May you anoint them with your spirit, keep them safe as they travel these city streets, give them wisdom as they discern the laws and as they protect us from those things that are evil. Lift them up as they go out each day. Give them strength and courage to face those things are, that are in front of them. And also give them compassion. Compassion for those who might not be worthy sometimes, but may they have your compassion and peace to be with the people of this city. We ask all these things in your name. Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Uh, once again, welcome to Ocala PD. Uh, thank you for showing up today and uh, for uh, participating in a very special day, not just for the police department, but for, for certainly for your loved ones. Uh, I want to thank all of you uh, who helped them get to where they're at today. Uh, without the support, uh, love, and, and uh, assistance from their, from their families, friends, and significant others, they clearly couldn't be here with us. Uh, I also want to say thank you for allowing them to become part of us and for you to become, uh, for you to, to come part of, become part of our family because uh, we really truly are a family here at Ocala PD. And, uh, and this is a very special day for them, and it's a special day uh, for, for us. This is probably one of the most diverse uh, groups of officers that we've hired uh, in a long time, and this is the largest crowd we've had in a very, very long time. So this is awesome. Uh, I, I noticed there's some, uh, everybody in the room is, is significant and important, and I've noticed several uh, former uh, police officers, uh, not just from Ocala PD, but also from the sheriff's office in the room. So thank you for coming. And uh, some former mayors, or at least one former mayor in the, in the audience too. So thank you. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to recognize someone that we've promoted uh, to uh, supervisor, uh, Donna Gwynn. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're going to make me cry. <laughs> All right, I got to breathe here for a second. In 1992, uh, Donna was uh, instrumental. Actually, she is the reason that we have a victim witness advocate program here at Ocala PD. Um, so, for the last 21 years, she's been involved in our program, started it from nothing, and has brought it to what it is today, which is really a nationally recognized victim advocate program. <laughs> Uh, for years and years, we have abused Donna and uh, not paid her for the work that she's done. And fortunately, this year, with a great deal of support from our mayor and our city council, we've been able to uh, stop. Sorry. <laughs> uh, we were able to, uh, to justify, which should have been justified 10 years ago, uh, her to become a supervisor of the department. Now, we don't normally have promotional ceremonies for our non-sworns because we don't swear so we don't swear them in, but we thought it was a very important for us. Oh, come on. She couldn't, thought she couldn't fit. <laughs> it's certainly an honor for us to be able to promote her to supervisor uh, that was effective Tuesday, right? It was effective October Tuesday. October 1st. Yeah, October 1st. So, <laughs> so congratulations. You do a wonderful job. We love you. Thank you very much. Awesome. And I would just like to... All right, uh, this is the part of the ceremony we, uh, where we're going to swear the new officers in. The way we do this for the family is when the officer's name is called, the mayor is going to, uh, to, to swear them in. But then we ask for uh, their significant other special person, mom, dad, whoever they've chosen to come and hold the Bible, and then to pin the badge. It doesn't have to be the same person. It can be whoever they want. So um, 
so when the mayor calls your name, then ask your, uh, uh, your, your family member or whoever it is to come up and, and help, okay? Uh, and this is the mayor. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks, Chief. Um, and I'll sign this later. Yeah. All right. Uh, I, Kyle Randall Drawdy. I, Kyle Randall Drawdy. A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my abilities. To the best of my abilities. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And that I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. In the state of Florida. In the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Right. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the oh, state of Florida. State of Florida. <laughs> and of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will uh, faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer for the duty. city of Ocala, Florida. The duty of police sorry, officer. The police officer. Uh, for the city of so, Ocala, Florida. For the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And that I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And of the state of Florida. And the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. <laughs> Rachel Emily Mangum. I, Rachel Emily Mangum. A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer no. for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And that I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And of the state of Florida. And of the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Joseph Robert Markham. I, Joseph Robert Markham. A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. That I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And of the state of Florida. And of the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Are you ready? Yes, sir. All right. I, Cedric Leon Marks. I, Cedric Leon Marks. A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And that I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And of the state of Florida. And of the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Jonathan Ramjet. I, Emmanuel Jonathan Ramjet. 
A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. And of the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of a police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And I will support. Protect. Protect. And defend. And defend. The Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. And of the state of Florida. And of the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. I, Richard Connor Tuck. I, Richard Connor Tuck. A citizen of the state of Florida. A citizen of the state of Florida. And of the United States of America. In the United States of America. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully perform. That I will faithfully perform. To the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. The duties of police officer. The duties. The duties of police officer for the city of Ocala, Florida. The duties of police officer of the city of Ocala, Florida. And that I will support. And I will support. Protect. Protect and defend and defend the Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States and of the state of Florida and of the state of Florida. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, I want to just. I'd like to say, too, for, for you that don't know, that this boy is, uh, or this man, is, is the great-grandson of M.O. Tuck. That was a, uh, a policeman on this force in Ocala for 14 or 15 years, years ago. Uh, the family's proud of him, and I know he'll pick up where his great-grandfather left off. You know, when he uh, when he uh, applied over here, uh, they called me uh, as a reference, and uh, Connor and, and, and Bill and Marie, they, they grew up, they were lived next door to me. Connor grew up next door to me, and um, they said, you know, can you say good things about him? I said, sure. I said, you know, other than, other than when he was five years old, he was, you know, pretty good. There were a couple incidents. And, uh, <laughs> but uh, they said, well, well, who is he? I said, well, when you come to work in the morning, do you, do you walk in the front of the uh, uh, the building? They said, sure. I said, stop and look to your right. I said, there's a there's a uh, memorial for M.O. Tuck uh, there. I said, that's his uh, great-grandson. They said, oh, okay, that Tuck. <laughs> and uh, so anyway, so so we're uh, we're happy to have you with us. And uh, it's a real honor, and uh, you know we've got a. I think your uh, your dad, you know, bought a bought a uh, a dog, a uh, who's working right now. Otherwise, you know, we're going to try to have uh, have the uh, canine uh, be here. But no, we're just real proud of you, and, and glad to have a tuck back in the fold. So, congratulations. Um, <laughs> So this is this is part of my job that that's probably the best part of my job is swearing in uh, police officers and getting to stand in front of uh, law enforcement and say good things about the work that you do. Um, for all those obviously that that work here, you already know this is the best police department um, in the country, if not the world. Uh, and I don't I don't say that lightly. Um, you know I get to ride with these officers, see what they do. I probably get in their way every once in a while, but you know, I love watching them work. Uh, but um, we're very, very appreciative of the work that, that these men and women do every day. Um, it doesn't get any better than this. Uh, no disrespect to the folks from the sheriff's office uh, in the room. Uh, uh, and my good friend, uh, Mr. Nix, uh, who I love riding with. Uh, but, uh, but anyway, uh, thank everyone for being here. Like I said, this is the largest crowd we've had here, even yeah. maybe bigger than when you came back. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but anyway, so but, but we're thankful to, to have these men and women join us, and uh, I'm sure they're going to do great things out there. And uh, to all the families, thank you for sharing them with us uh, and allowing them to do their job and, and, and be uh, with the uh, Ocala Police Department. But again, thanks for everybody being here today. Appreciate it.
Okay, welcome to the family. Welcome to the family. Uh, uh, this concludes the ceremony. We're going to take a lot of pictures. We'll stay here as long as you want. We'll take pictures with the families, but we do want to get a group shot of you guys, uh, and we'll do whatever you guys want us to do. But thank you so much for coming, and uh, stay in uh, fellowship with our new officers. Thanks.